everyone, my name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is A Voice in the Night. Samuel is called by God. Let's read. <coughs> Hannah was sad because she had no children. She prayed. And God gave her a son, Samuel. She was very grateful. So she gave Samuel to God to serve him. So, Hannah had a children. And Hannah didn't have any children. So she was very sad. So, like, she was, she was thinking... And she prayed to God and she has finally had a son. So she gave the Samuel to serve God. Hannah left her boy, little boy at the temperance with Eli, the priest. Samuel helped old blind Eli. She even slept in the temperance while Eli slept in the room nearby. So Hannah left her boy, Samuel, in the temperance to help Eli and serve God. One night, Samuel heard someone call his name. He got up and ran to Ellie. Here I am, he said. I don't call you. I didn't call you. Ellie grunted. Go back to bed. So one night, Samuel heard like someone calling his name. So he thought he was Ellie. Because all Ellie was there in those times. But Ellie, it wasn't Ellie. Question. Hannah gave her son Samuel to Ellie to help him serve God in the temple. It's true. Samuel crept back to bed. He heard his name. Samuel ran back to Ali. Here I am, he said. I didn't call you. Ali sighed, sleepy. Go, go back to bed. So Samuel crept back. Went in. Went. He again heard the sound. But it wasn't Ali. Who did Samuel live with? Uh, live with as he served God in the temple. Number three, Ali. Right. After Samuel heard the voice a third time, <coughs> Ali said, "It was the Lord." If he calls again, said Ali, "Speak. Say, speak, Lord." Your servant is listening. So Samuel did. So Samuel was like again heard the the voice third time. So Ellie said, "I didn't call you. Maybe it is the Lord. If you hear that again, speak. Say, speak, Lord. 
Your servant is listening. So somehow obeyed Ellie. Samuel, God said, "Can you be my prophet and pass my wonderful, <laughs> my words faithfully on to my people?" I can," said Samuel, and he did until he was an old man. So, like God said, Samuel, can you be my prophet to pass my word? To the people, so Samuel said, "Yes, I will." So he was, he did that until he was an old man. Question: Did God ask Samuel to the to? Be a prophet to pass over his message to the people. Yes. Yes. Today I read the Bible story. There's many time left, so I will read. I will do the activity. I will call it a story. Oh, that the Samuel. We have to call it those things. Maybe this can be orange. I like orange and yellow. Like I am also wearing yellow color. Oh no. I like sky, sky blue the most. Oh, no. what? What happened? Never mind. <laughs> Can be any color thing. Well, actually, I don't do the activity many times because it is not that fun. It is hard to color this. Maybe his clothes can be green. <laughs> mm, so Samuel will be God, but he don't know who I've called him. But it'll be very, you know. I think if I am Samuel, I will be very scared because, like, like he heard the voice in the night, and even Ellie didn't call him. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy them? Next time I'll read another good story. I'll see you next time. Bye.